Hi, my name is Andrew Isaacs. I'm a divorce lawyer. I'd like to talk to you today about family law and in particular the family court. In April 2014 we had a, a big bang. Uh, our president, the president of the family division, Sir James Munby, uh, brought in a lot of reforms and what happened was that instead of having a magistrate's court, a county court and a high court, we had a one court that was unified called the family court. Now we still have high court judges sitting in it, we still have magistrates sitting in it, and district judges and circuit judges. Uh, so on the face of it, you would think, well, nothing's changed. But things have changed, and they are changes will continue to happen. That now the reforms that were brought in have not been fully implemented throughout the country yet. Uh, some judges are set in their ways and are not keen on new changes. And so, despite the fact that the law says you have to do it a certain way, if at the end of the day a judge says no, then the answer is no, uh, because the judge is the final arbiter in his own courtroom, unless, of course, you appeal. And uh, in my experience, uh, it's better to get it right first time than try to win on an appeal. Now, what you have to bear in mind is that because things are constantly changing, um, it creates a lot of uncertainty. And where there is uncertainty, there is some degree of confusion, and consequently it does mean that you probably uh, need representation more at that time than you would do in other circumstances. Now, I'm not saying to you that you have to use a solicitor. You don't. You can do things on your own if you choose to. And I'm hoping that if you do do that, this website's going to help you because we're giving videos here, telling you things, giving you some tips and tricks. Um, but there are many, many ways in which a case can unfold. And I know I've been doing this a long time. So what you need to do is... Um, be aware of the fact that we are living in uncertain times. Lots of change is going on and you need to just be aware of the political background. And I say political with a small p uh, because that's what it is. We are living in uncertain times. So bear that in mind. So that's the family court. It will be constantly developing uh, and constantly changing. That is for certain. Um, and you'll also see that law in this country, as determined by the High Court, the Court of Appeal, the Supreme Court, is to some extent being re-examined by the President and also by Mr Justice Mostyn, um, who are both approaching um, principles of law which have been fairly set and cast in stone and are looking at them afresh. So there is a degree of change as well. So case law is quite important uh, and for you to keep abreast of that. So uh, but if you need um, to know where to find case law, there are other videos on, on this website about that, which I hope will be helpful to you. So we live in uncertain times, and uh, as long as you know that, then uh, you're as wise as I am.